I'm in the palm grove at the Royal Botanic Garden, Sydney, and I've come to see one of our largest and most magnificent trees. And looming high above the palms in the palm grove is this beautiful Agathus robusta, or the Queensland cowrie pine. The Queensland cowrie pine is a conifer. It's in the family Araceraceae, and that's the family that includes both the Norfolk Island pine and the Wollamai pine. It's also related to the New Zealand cowrie pine, Agathus australis. Now this tree was planted in 1853, and it was planted from seed collected by gardens director, John Can Bidwell. Even though this tree is over 160 years old, it's still only in its relative middle age for a Queensland cowrie pine. So it's thought these trees can grow well over 300 years old. Agathus robusta is not a flowering plant, so it's a conifer. It produces male and female cones. And here are the male cones, you can see they're quite small, and they release the pollen. The pollen's spread by wind, the female cones are much larger, and they're smooth and rounded, and they're what produce the seed if they're pollinated. The botanic name Agathus is actually the Greek word for ball of string. Agathus robusta, or the Queensland cowrie pine, has what we call a disjunct distribution. So it occurs in New Guinea, and then it occurs in a couple of places in Queensland. So one is on the Atherton Tableland, just south of Cairns, and the other is on Fraser Island and also around the region of Maryborough. These trees were much sought after for their timber, which was very resistant to pest particularly insect attack. And they also exude a sap or gum, which was used for helping to seal boats or corking up boats in the 18th and 19th century.